All right, great. Thank you so much, Jeanette. And thanks for joining me back to Toast to Traders. You know, I love these events and I'm always appreciative of being able to speak to your guests. And before we get started, um, I like to know who I'm talking to. If you guys wouldn't mind typing into the chat box where you're tuning in from, because I'm always curious. I've been doing this for a long time and I actually had somebody uh, tune in from Papua New Guinea recently, and I'm trying to find exotic places. So uh, we got Fresno. All right, I was just there recently. Uh, USA, of course. I'm still in the USA. Illinois, Oregon, Australia, West Palm Beach, Brooklyn. Yeah, keep typing it in. It's nice to know, um, you know, great big world, but small trader community. Tucson, welcome Tucson, Silverdale, Chicago. Awesome, awesome. All right, um, I'll probably yell out a few if I see something like really interesting. Papa New Guinea, still waiting for him to show up again. So anyway, identify market breakouts in advance with this insanely accurate trading tool. And seven of the best trading hacks known to man, but not known to most traders. So by the time you leave today, I wanna make sure that you guys know what these are and incorporate them with all your trading. And they make me do this, and I'm sure you've heard this so many times, it probably bores you to tears. But here's the, the big thing about this risk disclaimer. It's true and it's for real and I don't want you to hurt yourself. So don't risk money trading that you cannot kiss goodbye and then wake up the next day without it changing your life in any adverse way. Okay, is that fair? Let's just move on from that. I think the lawyers are happy. All right, so how did I get here? 29 years ago, and I will be changing this slide, is when I started trading back in the early 90s. And um, it was crazy because I didn't know what I was doing. I got a, a, a brochure in the mail uh, showing a head and shoulders pattern. I started thinking about you know shampoo products, but I quickly realized it wasn't that. I had more hair in those days. Um, I ended up placing a trade, I'm gonna tell you about that in a moment, using that very same pattern that I saw in a brochure and it changed my life, imagine that. Since then, I've hosted a live trade room for nearly 18 years, I've got many thousands of hours in the markets trading and just watching and following and my eyeballs turning into corkscrews. I've mentored many, many traders all over the world, probably thousands, I lost count, but for sure thousands of traders are using my numerous trading strategies, some of the best performing strategies that are available on the market today. So I've been told, I mean, they still work years later. And um, many of these traders I've gotten to know and they've attended my boot camps, and I'm just really thrilled to have been able to touch so many lives in such a positive way. I'm an avid traveler, I'm known as the backpack trader, but I wanna say right now that it's not, doesn't mean you have to schlep a backpack around. The backpack trader, I like to travel, I started schlepping a backpack around as a result of that head and shoulders trade, which you'll find out in a moment, but the point is, is that trading should give you an element of freedom in your life that you can't get any other way. And that's where we wanna to get to. And that's hopefully what I'm gonna be able to help you get to by the end of this presentation. I'm also a newly published author of the Day Trading Quick Start Guide. This has become a top seller on Amazon, which is blowing my mind. I never would have expected that, but I'm thrilled about that. So I'm gonna give two of these books away today. I'm gonna to autograph them for you. But the only catch is when I ask you quiz questions, the first person to answer with the right answer is going to win the book. Two people. So be sure you're on your toes and paying attention. And I will let you know when those questions come up. And um, this has been really fun. I've sent many of these out and it's I just love it. All right. So hopefully you guys will get some out of this book if you win. And if you don't win, well, hopefully you'll get even more out of this presentation, especially these seven trading hacks. These are super important. These themes have worked their way through my career over and over, in and out of everything I've done. It's what I've learned. And um, so with today's agenda, I'm gonna go through those as quickly as I can, but thoroughly. And then I'm gonna talk to you about key exhaustion levels, all right? And this is gonna get into a strategy that I'm gonna present and give you a demo on. Uh, the key exhaustion levels, and of course, knowing the balance of power between buyers and sellers, two very important 
pieces of information that's also quite elusive for most traders. All right, but if you know these things, you're going to be better off than most traders out there. So that's why it's so important. And then we'll get into my lab and I will show you some uh, great examples on why this is being touted as such an insanely accurate um, indicator. It's actually a set of indicators. All right, so let's go back to that head and shoulders trade, which is also known as the wife trade. And it's not that I'm out there trading wives, I'm not. It's just that this trade led me to meeting my wife. And the way it worked, first of all, this is a chart of the pound US, and this is dating back to 1991, 1992. It's a very famous moment in history. And I unwittingly shorted the British pound. I mean, it wasn't unwitting. There was a head and shoulders pattern that I just got in a brochure, right? I threw some money at it. And I I guess it worked because I took my several thousand dollars that I made and I ended up backpacking through Europe. Well, what it turned out becoming was a trade that went down in history, infamously known as the trade that broke the Bank of England. A guy by the name of George Soros was also selling the pound against other currencies as well, and he made billions of dollars. I took my few grand, and it was more than a few, but let's just say several thousand dollars, and traveled through Europe, and being a drummer, picked up a set of bongos along the way, started sitting in the street musicians, and just had the time of my life. There I am on the Charles Bridge in Prague, playing with a gentleman from South America in front of all these people, Long story short, I went to visit my friend in Caracas, Venezuela the following year. Within 24 hours, I met the lady who I've been married to now for 26 years. And there's our happy family up in the right-hand corner. And of course, the backpack trader was born, as were my kids. I didn't know it at the time that I would become the backpack trader. That came after. But as you can see, trading changed my life. And here's the point. It's too darn important to get wrong. Trading is important because what it can do for you in your life is, is profound, as you can see what it did for mine. Now, maybe I just got lucky. I have an app for trading because I did pretty well going forward as well, but I was still missing stuff. And actually, like you, I found myself sitting in webinars trying to fill in the missing blanks with knowledge and information. I realized there was so much that I still didn't know. And I was in a webinar just like this, listening to a speaker, got inspired, and that led to me becoming a host of a trade room. I mean, it's a kind of a twisty, long story, but that's basically how it happened. So let me ask you guys this. It changed my life. Are you guys ready for it to change your life? Because here's the thing. If you can make a commitment to yourself, that's the first step to you actually making it happen. So I want you guys to type into the chat box, yes, yes, I'm ready. I'm ready to do what it takes. I'm ready to make the change. I'm ready to learn what I need to learn. I'll even schlep a backpack around or not, because I don't care if you trade from the Orient Express or your own sofa or anywhere in between. I just want you guys to make this commitment to yourself. It's not to me. It's not for me. It's for you. If you type it in, you're typing it in for yourself. Steve says yes, Jill says yes, Don yes, Tim yes, uh, Kazewa, I'm ready, Jim, yep. Keep typing it in, guys. There's a lot of people in this room. If you're not typing it in, then you gotta ask yourself if, if trading's really that important. It is. Type it in, it's a commitment to yourself and you need to make it or you're never gonna take that first step. All right, so let's get into these seven trading hacks because the way I look at it, this is the first step. All right, so what I want you guys to do is take a screenshot of this or write these down. It's even better because then you remember it. Let me read them off quickly and then we'll get into them one by one. So number one, prove it to yourself. Seems obvious, most people don't do it. Number two, power of the trade plan. Number three, dance with the markets, control and surrender. That's an interesting one, right? Number four, lifestyle. Trade less, make more. Yeah, that's actually true. Number five, 2% rule. Number six, Einstein. And number seven, the 5% art. Uh, hopefully I've got you guys a little bit provoked. This is meant to be provocative. Let's get into them one by one. All right, so prove it to yourself. What does that mean? 
You've all heard of Clint Eastwood's movie, The Good, The Bad, and The Ugly. Hopefully, maybe not. I mean, it's a long time ago. Maybe I'm showing my age. Anyway, I've renamed it The Good, The Bad, The Ugly, and The Great. Why did I do that? Why is it so critical? Let's take a look at this little spreadsheet down here on the bottom. This is a screenshot of a tool that I use, an advanced tool. I call it the UTA, the Ultimate Trade Analyzer. I've been using it for years and giving it to my members for years. It's how we analyze trades. And what's amazing about it is that it lets you slice and dice your data and give you all kinds of great information about your trading, your strategy, your method, et cetera. But the most important part of all, this often gets overlooked, is the development of the win-loss column that you see on the right side. Now, this is just a small sample. But the point is, is that no matter what strategy you use, there will always be a random distribution of wins and losses. You could be trading a strategy that wins 90% of the time. What's the other side of the coin? 10% will lose. And when will that happen? Randomly. In fact, you could lose 10 in a row, and many of you will quit, and you'll be throwing away a strategy with a 90% win rate. That sounds crazy, right? But this is reality. This is what trading is. And until you learn about the win-loss column and the random distribution of wins and losses, you'll never be able to prove that your strategy will make you money. And if you can't prove it yourself first, you're just going to keep chasing the next thing as your account goes down and down and down. You have to work harder to refund it and recharge it. How many of you have blown up your trading accounts and how many times, right? We all know this. So here's the thing. When you go through the good, the bad, the ugly, the great, you're going through this work, you're trying to prove it yourself, and you're putting in another trade and you're log, oh my God, it lost again, and you get that reflux, and it feels like you're getting kicked in the stomach, and it's only a back test, but you still feel it. You keep going, then the winners come in, and you see the equity grow, grow, grow. And despite the ugly, the great comes rolling in, and you recognize, oh my goodness, this is a business that makes money. Not, I'm not just saying this is a trading method that makes money. It's a business that makes money because trading is all numbers. It's a numbers game. So this is another way to look at it. If we go back, think of every trade as a tree in your forest, okay? Maybe you're gonna have to sacrifice some of the trees to grow your forest larger. In fact, not even maybe, for sure you will. You sacrifice a third of the trees to grow your forest two thirds larger. But if you're a little guy running around, a little grunt on the forest floor trying to dodge falling trees, you're never going to have the perception of what the forest is. So the forest is your equity curve. Imagine starting here on the left and getting up to here on the right. Can you do it? Look at all these trees falling. This is what real trading is. If you don't prove it to yourself, you're probably going to wait until you see all the good trades happen, then you're gonna start trading here and the one step back is gonna happen. Some trees are gonna fall, you're gonna try not to get crushed, you will get crushed, and then you're not gonna be left standing to catch the next growth spurt up because you have no concept of the forest. You're running around the trees trying to, trying to um, not get hurt, trying to avoid losing trades instead of trying to operate a winning trading business. See the difference? When, you're, when you decide to stop being that guy or gal trying to trade and instead make yourself the CEO of your trading business, things will start to change. But it begins with proving it to yourself first. And I'm spending more time on this number one hack because this is by far the most important thing you can do if you hope to have long-term ongoing success as a trader. Could I get an amen on that? Is there anybody that disagrees? Interact with me and let me know because I understand I rub people wrong sometimes. I don't care. I'm doing this for you. It's coming from pure love and affection. Trust me on that. I've been dealing with traders a long time. This is a fact. I'm not lying. <clears throat> All right, so let's go on. Power of the trade plan. This is also super important. You have to have this in order to be able to prove to yourself. Okay, if you don't have a trade plan, what are you going to prove? A trade plan is going to give you um, measurable results that you can test and prove. And you don't even have to risk your money. That's the beauty of what we do. You can do this before you put your money at risk. How come so many traders don't do this? 
it befuddles the imagination. Why? I don't. I do not know. But you can. You all. You all typed in. You're ready to start doing it right. So here's the thing: a trade plan gives you a start time, a stop time. What you're going to trade, how you're going to trade it, what method, where's your entry, where's your target, how are you going to do things? It gives you mechanical rules to follow, and then you can get measurable results and test it first. So here's that's that's an overall trade plan and then you want each individual trade to be fully planned you've all heard plan your trade trade your plan it's so obvious and yet again so many people fail to do it but with my strategies you always know exactly what the trade is you know where your entry is your targets your stop you know how much your rewards are to each target you know what your risk is your risk reward ratios everything at a glance just by clicking on a bar and I'm gonna show you exactly how it works, but this is a piece of a trade that actually happened in the trade room some time ago, and now I'm gonna show you what it looked like. This is what we were just looking at here. This was the actual trade that set up, and this is um, later, this is what I just showed you the blow up as it finished, all right? But when you click on the bar, now you see the entire trade, and below that, visually, the little plus signs your entry. It's below the line here, so you know you're going short. These are your targets. These are your stop. This is your stop. These are the rules you follow. This is your trailing stop to protect your profits and lock it in all the way down. The whole thing is planned from start to finish. With this, you can accomplish hack number one and prove to yourself you've got something that's going to make you money. Be prepared for a lot of sleepless nights because when you experience this, like so many others, myself included, you'll probably lose sleep. Why? Because you're too darn excited and can't wait to start your trading day tomorrow. Okay, so fair warning. All right, number three, dance with the markets. This is super important too. Price action leads the dance, yet so many of us try to control the trade once we're in it. Stop doing that. You have to surrender to your plan and to the market let the market lead you should be subservient to this rhythm of the market's dance follow the rhythm follow the price action and the way it works and the way you really learn how this dancing with the market um, is effective is when you have a strategy that tunes itself in real time and can adjust to market conditions bar after bar so when the market's dancing slow you slow dance when the market's dancing fast you speed dance and it might take smaller steps or bigger steps. And what I mean by that is if you look at these two trade examples, here's a long trade, look at the targets, not that big, it's kind of a small trade and the price comes up, but look how accurate that final target was before it started heading down. Then you had a short trade and it's a larger trade. Look how much larger these targets are further away and look at how the price came down and hit those perfect targets, this time target two before heading up. Okay, the whole point is, is that when you surrender to the market, you take what the market wants to give you and your strategy should do the same thing, right? That's a very important hack and you surrender. Don't try to control, you can't control. All right, so another example, same market, different size trade. This one's quite a bit larger, 26 cents, $260 a contract. Look how accurate that was. All right, so this is a crude oil contract, but it doesn't matter what the symbol is. This is gonna work on anything. All right, so the next one is the power of the lifestyle. And lifestyle is so important because so many people are sitting in front of their computers all day long trying to find trades. That's just no way to live your life. Once you prove a trade plan yourself, now you just need to um, trade it and get done quickly. Hit your goals, turn the computer off and leave. Don't sit there all day long because you're trading to have a better life. You're not living to trade, hopefully, all right? So here's another mistake people make. Yeah, but I gotta pay my electric bill or my mortgage, and they force their trades. Instead of what we just learned from dancing with the market, take what the market wants to give you. So if you put the needs of your trading first and not worry about your personal needs, which I know is hard to do, but you have to, because your trading doesn't care if it's hard, your trading needs what it needs, your trading will take care of your personal needs at some point. Think like a business person. Businesses take time to ramp up and to grow. And speaking of ramping up and growing, you'll learn why this is so important when we look at the next hacks 
coming, okay? But the whole point is the less you trade, probably the better you're gonna do. That's just the way it works. The 2% rule is so important. The three-legged stool, you've probably all heard it. Trade management, I mean, um, uh, trade methodology, money management, and trade psychology. And if you take one of those legs away, the stool follows, falls. Okay, you have to have all three legs. So money management is what this is about, is how you manage your trades. Most traders risk too much and over trade. It goes back to trading too much in the wrong lifestyle, but it's also how large of a position you take. Don't treat this like a gambling thing. Otherwise, you know, we know what happens to gamblers. They typically lose. You don't want to rely on luck. What you need to do is understand what the ramp is and never risk more than about 2% of your capital on any given trade. So from the entry to your stop, you could determine what that risk is. And then that tells you what your position size is. So if you got $10,000, you want to risk 2%. You have an entry and a stop. On crude oil futures, for example, at $10 a tick, you can't risk more than 20 cents or 200 bucks if you want to stick with that 2%. Now, what happens as your account grows? The 2% grows. But don't forget, there's a random distribution of wins and losses, and you want to still be standing when the winners come in. Doesn't that make sense? So 2% can get you rich. Here's how. The ramp is one of the most misunderstood parts of trading. But Einstein taught us that the eighth wonder of the world is the power of compounding. So these are a bunch, this histogram represents a trade plan with position size being added and taken away, added and taken away as one account grows by taking the trades in the plan. And the front end, these first couple months, doesn't look like there's much progress being made. This is where most traders quit and fail. They have to give their trading time for the great to happen and the winners to come pouring in what they've been able to prove themselves first. And notice what happens when you hit that exponential curve. It zooms up to a thousand units, maybe starting with just one unit. Okay, it doesn't matter what the symbol is. This is meant to teach you something. Once you get to your 2%, I mean, um, your maximum level, then you're just trading, right? You, you're, you're, you're not gonna keep growing because you've hit your maximum level. So at 2% here, imagine where you are here. Now you're risking like one-tenth of 1% 1 of your account with a thousand units. No one's gonna lose sleep over that. You're gonna be quite wealthy at that point. But here's the thing you have to understand. Do you guys know that if you can make $50 average net profit per trade per contract, just $50 that you can grow a $10,000 a month income if you risk 2% on every trade going forward? As your account grows, you increase your position size. So when you factor in all wins and losses and your net profit is $50 per contract, per trade, you're on the road to a $10,000 a month income and about a quarter million dollar trading account in about two years time. Depends on how much you start with. That example um, assumes you're starting with 20 grand. So you kind of have to work the numbers to figure it out. But the whole point is, is that it doesn't really require much when you apply Einstein's eighth wonder of the world, the power of compounding. This is an amazing concept that most traders don't even think of or even know exists. That's just five little cents, five pennies of crude oil trading, a nickel. Crazy, right? All right, so let me just quickly go on. Um, the 5% arc to trading is merely where, you know, you the trade plan is shown on the, chart you could see it but sometimes you got to put your brain into things and you don't want to get long like two ticks in in front of major resistance push the entry out a little beyond it and force the price action to confirm it actually wants to break through little things like that we call it the key level adjustment insurance policy so you give up a tiny bit and it will help you avoid some trades that may end up losing for example and you work that into your rules. So that could become a mechanical rule also, but it's not something we wanna program in. It's something we wanna learn and pay attention to. It's how a, sh a cook becomes a chef, how they put that extra tococito into the recipe to make that plate come alive. You want your trading to get to that point. And I hope you understand my metaphors. I love to cook in the kitchen. The whole idea is eventually you learn to just lean on your system and this 5% art side of trading, you learn 
don't be an artist of 50%. Don't put too much of yourself into it. We're just talking about a little tococito, right? A little touch. That's it. But ultimately, you learn to just lean on the system. All right. So um, I'm going to run out of time. So I'm going to have to blast through this. I'm going to teach you about key exhaustion levels. So you've heard about Muhammad Ali's rope of doping. Um, that's where he covers up until his opponent gets tired. So the name of my strategy, you will see, takes advantage of this, and so do the setups. Um, ultimately, we're waiting for either buyers or sellers to become exhausted, and that's what these dots are, okay? So these blue, red, red dots tell us that the sellers are getting tired, or the yellow, blue, green dots tell us I'm sorry, the buyers are getting tired, right? It's coming up, the buyers are getting tired, the blue, red, red, then the sellers take over. On the left, you can see these dots down below, the sellers got tired and the buyers start taking over. This is a visual cue that's very important and extremely useful for us traders. Um, all right, so here's the quiz. You guys ready? Let's go. Three, two, one, go. What does this mean long short or out type it in if you want an autographed copy of my book all right i see people typing it in three choices yeah all right you guys are really paying attention dave freeman you're the winner you're the first one to type it in please send us your email i mean um send us by email your address and i will send you an autographed copy that you can pin to your wall and throw darts at if you want or maybe you read it Hopefully you get some out of it. All right, here's the next quiz. You guys ready? What does this mean? Long, short, or out? All right, I see people saying out, 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 out. Yeah, Um. well, you know what? I have to give you guys credit because you are paying attention. This actually doesn't mean anything. I'm, I'm pranking you guys. So Norman said neither. All right, yeah, you guys should get credit, but actually this is just my chance to laugh and have some fun. So just seeing who's paying attention. This one, this one, there is no winner. <laughs> Sorry. But the next one is, so let's go. Ready? Long, short, or out? What is it? Oh, man, you guys are quick on the draw there. I think we got female power winning this time. I can't even scroll up to find. Lynette, Lynette, you're the one. You're the winner. So, Lynette, please uh, send in your address, and we'll, I'll get you a book. Thanks, guys. Thanks for the fun and thanks for paying attention. Let's move on because now you can see where buyers and sellers are exhausted. So when I get to my uh, trading demo, you'll you'll be able to get uh, understand what's going on. So the final thing to the piece of this puzzle is knowing the balance of power. And Confucius always says, don't get dragged into the crocodile pit. So what do I mean by that? Well, there's a great tug of war between buyers and sellers. Buyers and sellers are pulling and, and they're pulling on the price, and there's a line that marks the balance of power between buyers and sellers. We call it the signal line. It's also known as the balance line. It's a very unique indicator. In fact, ancient rice merchants used it in feudal Japan in the in the very early marketplaces when they were, you know, the vending rice, basically. And it's an amazing indicator that still works to this day. And it's really simple. When the price is closing above the line, the buyers are in charge. That line is like the crocodile pit, right? It's a moving line in the sand that marks the balance of power. You don't want to be a seller because you're going to get dragged right in as the buyers are in charge, right? And when the market turns and the price starts closing below the line, the sellers are in charge. Pretty cool, huh? If you have both these indicators, you're going to be better off than 90% of the traders out there. So um, we're going to start looking at a naked chart, and I'm going to reconstruct one of my all-time best strategies that has been working for years with thousands of users worldwide, still use it in my trade room every single day, and I'm going to teach it to you really fast right now, all right? So if you know this stuff, you're better off than 90% of the traders out there. Fair enough? All right, let's get started. I got to grab my chart here. All right, so hopefully you guys can see this. And, um, oops, if you can't see it, someone let me know, but hopefully you can. So this is a chart, forget the symbol, doesn't really matter what it is. Um, it's the Dowie Mini, but it could be anything. And the point I want you to, to ask yourself is on the right edge of the chart, 
do you know what's going to happen next? Is the price going to go up? Is the price going to go down? Does anyone really know? Because let's face it, you can look back and see what stuff did. You can see the price went up, went down, little choppy action in here, reversed up again, kind of a messy market at the moment. But what you trading happens here. Trading happens here, not looking backwards, but looking to the right, where you can't really see what's coming next, right? So does anyone want to venture a guess what's going to happen? Does anyone even know? I mean, the answer is no. Nobody knows, right? Nobody knows. So here's the thing. Let what happens when we put on our exhaustion dots? Hold on, I'm missing the... Uh... All right, yeah, so some of you are saying... Um go down or sideways sideways don't know it's impossible to know whoever said it's impossible to know got the answer right check this out now we got our exhausting indicator on there and it kind of kind of gives us some unique information doesn't it so we're getting a sense that maybe the buyers are getting tired all right what happens when we add our balance line now what that's a whole different way of looking at that chart isn't it now we got some context there's a good chance we might actually know what's going on. So the strategy is gonna use these things, but we still have missing information. There's one other indicator, well, there's actually two, but this one in particular is called the high trend chop indicator. And what this tells us is what's happening on a trend, um, on this fast trend of a chart five times slower than this. Okay, so this is a 14 point momentum bar. Every bar is 14 points. This is a really dynamic bar. It's based on price action, which is part of the strategy as well. So if you multiply 14 by five, I think that's a 70. Anyway, um, that's what this is. It's the fast trend on a chart five times higher. So we're gonna use this, use this information along with price action confirmation itself, Though, and, and there's gonna be some rules that are gonna then create trades. And the trades are gonna print right on the chart just the way I showed you. So I'm now gonna show you a session. First of all, all these day, uh, this works on day trading, swing trading, long-term position trading. I wanna show you some day trades because this all happened yesterday. I always show trade plans that are the ones we always use on the most current charts so that you can see how this works. No cherry picking, this is what actually is happening from yesterday's session. So. The YM starts at 8.30 Central Time, and let's just see what happens. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you that um, there was a trade earlier, but we're that's before 8.30. So we just have to wait and see, follow along and see if you can kind of um, follow along what the indicators are saying. So now we got sellers tired, a bar closes above the balance line. Um, we got a certain set of rules because it depends on um, the rules that the calculator will then print the trade. You don't have to think of what it is because it knows already. You can learn this stuff, of course you will, but the point is, is that you just want to trade. And so when you see an entry, you click on the bar and there's your whole trade right there. And the first step is to get to target one. When we get to target one, we're going to move that stop, which are these dots down here, and we're going to move them up and lock in one tick or one point and get to break even and even cover the cost of commission. So this is gonna aggressively get to a risk-free position at target one. Our objective is to get to either a target one, a target two, or a target three, depending on the chart and trade plan. This is a slightly larger size bar, uh, 14 points. So we're just interested in going to target one for that first target um, objective, but many traders are gonna go to target two. And target two is, um, one of the primary targets for many of our trade plans. And you can see how much you would make. Target one is gonna make you 24 points, $120. Target two is gonna make you 37 points, which is $185. Target three will make you $250 a contract. So it triggers in, it pushes up to target one. You could take profit there if you want. You move the stop up. Now the stop, your, your risk-free position. So if you wanna scale out at target one, keep another one on to trail or to target two, it hits a target two, and then it comes off a little bit, it hits a target three, the trailer is gonna follow the crocodile pit line, the balance line, and it comes up 
and ultimately stops out right here. And that's it. This trade was one and done. It hit the trade plan goals. You do not have to keep trading. Remember the random distribution of wins and losses. Quit your trading with a positive result. Less is more. Come back tomorrow. Do it again. This doesn't win on the first trade all the time, but it does quite often. And you could have minimal trading and like this, go your two to three steps forward, one step back, grow your account, run the ramp, hit your exponential curve. Don't be a slave to trading. Enjoy your life and have a trade uh, program that's going to serve you well from now until forever. You become your own best version of the backpack trader. This is the entire strategy in a nutshell. Let's look at, at some more examples really fast. Okay, this is yesterday's Dowie Mini. This could be traded on a 377 tick chart, could be traded on other types of charts. This one is just one that I happen to really like because it works great. All right, so let's go ahead and look at a bunch of other examples. So. How many of you like to trade uh, crude oil? You got any crude oil traders in here? It's one of the best markets to trade. And the reason why I'm gonna show it to you next, because every week in my trade room, I do the crude oil inventory report. It comes out once a week. And I use this strategy with this chart, the 377 tick at 10.30 on Wednesday, sometimes 11 on Thursday on holiday weeks. Okay, so this was this week's session. And I, you should know, that there's really nothing new to learn. Let's go back to where we start. It comes out at 10.30, we wait two minutes. So when we click on that setup, we're still a few seconds away from two minutes. You can see up here on the clock. But by the time we get to that third bar, it's still a valid setup, we're now two minutes in, that's our trade. So we can click on it and see what it is. Get short at 73.87. This is definitely a target two objective. We're not trying to get to target one, that's gonna to get to a risk-free position, but we're gonna take profit at target two, that's what this trade plan is. And the way we've been doing it for years, and I've been recording these sessions and putting them on my YouTube channel for years. Uh, anyway, so this was the session this week. It comes down, it's the target one. It's so visual. The system knows, the calculator knows what to do. The stop moves down, you move your stop. It's really easy, you just follow the template and it keeps, you keep moving your stop lower and lower, locking in more and more, and then it hits target two. And look at how it hit it exactly perfectly without a penny to spare before moving up and stopping out. That's why we say this is insanely accurate. It knew how to dance with the market, it knew how to calculate the right size trade, and it put on the perfect size, 26 cents, $260 a contract, and literally finished in four minutes. I mean, four minutes. I I'm saying goodbye to everybody. I don't need to keep trading. So one and done. Let's keep looking. Um, yesterday's ES, this is the S&P. Not my favorite market because it's kind of hard to trade. A lot of traders love it because you can grow it really large. But just to show you, starting at 8.30, there was a setup immediately, one minute later, and look at how accurate that target was. Target two, of course, only some we go to target one, mostly it's target two, and look at how accurate it hit that target before going up the other way, one and done on the session. Um, how about the NQ? There's so many ways to trade the NQ. It's a crazy market. This one also starting right at 8.30 Central, um, here's the setup. You can see it at 831 and look how accurate that target was. This is a 610 tick chart. That was good for $285 a contract. There was another trade, completely different. Now we're done with the first trade. We don't need to keep trading because we already hit our goals. If you want to trade more, just have different trade plans. So you're trading less with each plan, but trading more, you just add as many plans as you need to. All right. So there was a question on that S&P, where was the stop? The stop is very visual. It's, it, it, it was the dots on the other side of the trade. Okay. So um, because I have to move on, um, maybe we'll get back to it. But let me, I want to show you these other examples. This is where I want to show you the dancing also, because notice that target two is 14 and a quarter points here and how accurate it was. The next trade, the volatility expanded. And so the calculator knew that. And look at this. It was 19 and three quarter points, and look how accurate that target was. Pretty amazing, isn't it? This is all happening dynamic in live time. 
This is why the strategy has been working. It came out seven years ago and it works just as well today as it did back when. And, and forget the symbol, it doesn't even matter. Sometimes there's a small trade, sometimes there's a larger trade. So you just learn which what's the appropriate chart. One of my favorite markets is unleaded gas. Quick look at it. There was two trades. This starts at nine. 9 a.m. New York time, it's actually half an hour earlier than the 8.30 start time on the other markets, with it, which are Chicago time. So look at how it comes up, hits target one, the stop moves up, box in a little more, and then stops out. But remember, our objective is target two. Trade plan says we need another trade, so we get short. This one's got a lot of juice in it. It bangs through all the targets and then trails down a little further. And you can see the profit on this, 63 ticks. 84 ticks, 105 ticks. That's four dollars and twenty cents a tick. You should be done here. Some traders want to get two trades instead of one, especially with this market because it's so explosive. Those traders were very happy yesterday when this happened. Pretty cool, huh? So you get all these beautiful targets, but then you get the explosive move down to here, which was good for almost two grand at $4.20 a tick, 468 ticks. So that was a pretty good session. It was all yesterday, everything I'm showing you yesterday. Um, let's look at some swing trades really quick. I gotta get back to the slides so I can show you how you can get involved with this, but I know, who do we have in here that's a Forex trader? Do we have any Forex traders? This works great on Forex. A quick look at a, a swing trade on the US Swiss, and the reason why I wanna show it to you is because, again, it doesn't matter the pair or the symbol. Look at the accuracy of these targets. Now with Forex, we wanna scale out at each target for sure, because we can adjust our position size with the creative use of um, uh, micro lots, mini lots, full size lots. We can tune our position to that 2% risk. So, um, yeah, this works on MT4, so you could put it on a Bitcoin versus USD, you can put it on any of those pairs, and you can go through the prove it and the training, and I'll teach you how to do it so that you can work it just the same. I basically have you use this plan, it's going to work pretty much on anything. So, you know, 96 pips to here, look at the size changed, perfect target, 110 pips, a bigger one here, 139 pips, again, perfect target almost hit a perfect target too and came off, didn't quite get there and then stopped out. Still pretty darn accurate. I mean, nothing's perfect than a losing trade, but not a big losing trade because instead of stopping out all the way up here, it actually identifies the market's gonna go up and you get out at the long and you save about 25% on what would have been a bigger loss and it puts you in a very accurate long trade. And then a short trade, that um, this one loses too. So you got a couple losers, but then the winners come pouring back. So uh, I have to go through this quick because I'm running out of time. This always happens. I really need 90 minutes. Let me just get to what's happening now. The most current trade is this one. And it you look at the stop, so perfectly placed. And then it's already gone through now all three targets and it's still trailing. So, this is a swing trade on, on XXX YYY pair. It's the US Swiss, but it could be anything. It doesn't really matter. Okay, obviously you're gonna to wanna to trade the best of the best. You learn how to do that. I teach you all this stuff with the training. Quick look at a five minute chart. This was yesterday as well. Starts at 8.30 and the first, there were some earlier trades that did really well, but we wait to our start time. And um, at 8.30, there was nothing until this time here. It was actually 9.35 was the first trade taking profit with 25 pips right here, and then it comes down and stops out. Again, a very accurate target, and a winner, one and done. That's all you need, guys. Do that every day or as many days as possible. Um, and then I'm saving the most powerful for last, and that's the swing trading stocks and equities, okay? There's a question, do you trade multiple contracts and scale out to catch a runner? Absolutely, yes, if, you, if your account could afford that with the 2% rule. So you wanna grow it to the point where you can scale out because those are really good targets and then you do with certain markets like unleaded gas, you wanna be able to catch those explosive moves. Definitely yes. All right, so let me let you guys all remember the story of COVID-19. I mean, I don't mean to be facetious, it kind of slammed into our lives a little over a year ago. I wanna show you something. 
Um, all right, so we're, we're going to get to COVID in a moment. Um, prior to that, well, first of all, this is a spider, okay? We all know the spider. It's a really popular ETF. It's the S&P. And I want to show you how powerful this is to use these symbols, these setups to trade options, okay? When you click on the bar, you get um, – you get your entry. So you just buy in the money calls. So this is a September 314 call. And then, you know, you don't want to buy 100 shares of the S&P. It's too expensive at 330 bucks. Buy simple calls. And when you scale out at each target, you can just see the returns. 37%, 65%, 112%, 121%. And then COVID slams into our lives. Um, no, that's not COVID. Actually, the COVID example is the um, Qs. Let me get to the cues. What I was hoping to show you were just basically the accuracy again, but you guys got the picture already of the accuracy of these targets, right? You kind of got the clue that it doesn't really matter what it is. And I'm definitely running out of time, but I got to show you this. So COVID happens. This is a sell-off on COVID. The system picks up the short right around here. This is in March of 2020, okay? Panic has hit the world. Look at this perfect trade and this perfect target before the markets start going up. I'm going to introduce a new indicator. This is a bonus. It's called the trend mode indicator. We've used this with a strategy on some trade plans, and it merely says that you only go short when the line is red. You only go long when the line is blue. Pretty cool. It's really simple. And I just want you to follow this along because after that perfect short, at the end of the disaster, it's been all up from there, and the system just produced one winning trade after another, all the way up, perfect targets, unbelievable, avoids a losing trade because the line is blue, you don't go short, you only go long, it's a great filter, and then it brings us up to the current point in time, no, that's still October, you get the idea, right, just imagine call options just ringing the register every time, I mean, look, you could just see them, right, there's a losing trade, they happen sometimes, and that brings us right up to today's current trade, which just happened and just hit its first target, and a simple September call made 21% in a matter of days. Usually, you're making much more than that, but it's kind of a small trade. I think you get the idea. It works. <laughs> you could trade this in your retirement account and take these trades tax-free. So let me get back to my slide presentation. I went overboard like I typically do. I try not to, but it happens inevitably every time. So one second here, and let's just keep going. So the uh, trade plan, um, there's one that's been winning 80 plus percent of the time for the last 15 years. It comes with the membership. I didn't get a chance to show it to you. It's a pound yen. Four hour chart is really interesting. Um, the thing I want you to point to think about is this last part here. The day trade plans, I just showed you Friday's trades, okay, because that's the most current session. That's typically what I do, and I've been doing the same thing for years. And the whole thing is, is being able to quit your session with, a, with more money than you started, with a positive result, right, with minimal and efficient trading so that you could become your own best version of the backpack trader. All right, so let's keep moving. The crude oil report I showed you, it's such a strong plan. I've been trading it for years. I've got hundreds of testimonials. I started saving them back in 2011. This is a look at my Gmail. I just wanted to show you some dates on here, just so you can see. Some 2018, 2019, I need to show you some newer ones. So here's a guy that's had the CPX2, Counter Punch Express 2. By the way, in case you don't know what this is, that's what I'm showing you. He uses it for swing trading and natural gas, uh, having more positive trades. Um, another guy, Scott, this was, that, that was more recent. This was from several years ago. It shows you how well this is working, but basically he loves the rules. He loves the system. He's simply amazed, and um, he's got a 100% increase in his daily results per contract. It's pretty amazing. So, um, again, I got to go quick. You learn how to prove it to yourself. You know that we don't know, we don't know shit on the right edge of the chart, right? They bleep me out, but, you know, we're all adults here. Um, we learned how we need to dance with the market. Trading less is more. Hopefully, I've proven that to you. And um, the uh, be the CEO. Don't be that guy trying to trade. 
be the CEO of your trading business. So let me tell you how to get involved with the Counterpunch Express 2. All right, this is a process that works. Um, I, I'm gonna try to get through this quick so I can answer your questions. I see your questions. By the way, you can reach me at Troy at BackpackTrader.com and I will answer all questions that I don't have time for. So here's what you're gonna uncover with the Counterpunch Express 2. What do you think this is worth, by the way? I'm just curious. Um, a complete method of trading, right? You saw how versatile it is. I showed you Forex, futures, uh, day trading, swing trading. Didn't get to spend enough time with the swing trading. The equities and the options are just phenomenal. Next time I'll have to start with that. Um, it's newly upgraded because now it's actually tracking. It used to only show you the setups only, but now you see the stops tracking. It even lets you add supplemental trades so you can scale in when you become more advanced with additional setups. The control panel, when you click on the trade, the entire trade is there. I mean, what more can you ask for than when you plan your trade, you wanna trade your plan and you click on the bar and there's your whole trade plan in real time. That's a game changer. You get the high trend chop filter. That's the histogram that gives you the fast trend on the chart that's five times slower. That puts things into context. And the trade calculator uses that as part of the rules for certain high percentage setups. Um, and of course, proven and reliable, it's been working for years. You get all those indicators. It works on TradeStation, NinjaTrader 7 and 8. MT4 and Thinkorswim. So if you've got those, one of those platforms, you can use it on any or all of those platforms. Nuts to bolts, video-based training. Some of the best training I've ever done is actually contained with the Counterpunch Express 2, and you get access to it for life. The trend mode indicator, that's the when it's red, you go short, when it's blue, you go long. That is a webinar special. That's usually something I charge extra for, I'm giving it to you, no extra charge as a bonus. And then of course the trade plans, the very ones I've been showing you and a lot more already done for you included. You just have to follow the rules and prove it to yourself. All right, so um, what do you think it's worth? Well, it kind of stole my thunder here. It's only 497 bucks, guys. I mean, I showed you trades that made more than that in one trade. You literally pay this off with one winning trade, you own it for life. This is far too cheap, actually. $9.97 is probably a closer price. $12,000 or more is what it's probably worth if you think about it being a business owner. Uh, custom, you get all the indicators lifetime, all the training, trend mode indicator, done for you trade plans. It's only $497, and um, you get some bonuses. So. Not only do you um, get all the indicators, but you get access to my live trade room. You can join us in the trade room Monday through Thursday, starting at 9.30 New York time. You can ask us questions live. Who else does this where you can learn a strategy in live time with the guy that created it or some of my top performing trade coaches that probably know the strategy better than me by now uh, to teach it to you in real time. All of this is just 497 bucks. Crude oil report, I showed you this. Here's how it looks on Ninja Trader. This was quite a while ago, but it works exactly the same. This is a crude oil report done by one of my trade room coaches, and you can see it working beautifully. Um, of course, you get a great trader community that comes with, because you're gonna be surrounded by other great traders, and you learn so much, and you get a lot of feedback. We're always interacting with one another, and that's a value that always goes unheralded but it's an extreme value to become a member of an active trader community, all fighting the good fight you are. You learn so much. I learn from them too. You get the pre-programmed spreadsheet that I showed you, the ultimate trade analyzer. I want you to succeed. And with this, and I'm gonna teach you how to use it, you're gonna learn how to prove it to yourself first. If I was selling you this and nothing else, just this, it would be well worth 497 because what it would do for you. You get it as a bonus. That's what produces the forest guys so that you can prove it to yourself. You could start from here and end up here. When you can prove it to yourself and then you get those great setups and those great trades and you see it enough and practice it enough and learn it enough, you've got way more than most traders out there and you're gonna be able to succeed. All of this, 
497 bucks. It's a cost of a winning trade, maybe two, and that's it. And you own it all for life. So I believe, oh, there's one more slide, just kind of recaps everything. I got these two eBooks I'm gonna give you also, some other bonuses, multi-computer license. You can use it on your laptop, your home computer, your office computer. I'm not gonna stand in the way of your success. I want you to succeed. You can have this and use it on multiple computers. And I'm gonna give you these two eBooks that when you combine this with the Counterpunch Express training, that's your trade of religion. You've got everything you need. These two books are very powerful. The concepts in them, in addition to what you learn with Counterpunch, are gonna set you on the right path, step by step, to success. If you put a value on this, and we did the math, we kind of put some numbers on the value of all these things, we added it up to about 3,500 bucks, we're only charging 497. Literally, it's 90% off what we feel this is actually worth. First 50 people, this price has got to go up, but for now, we've still got uh, room left, and I hope you guys jump all over this because this can help you. I was looking at Mark's uh, presentation right before this, and these great indicators that give you this great big picture um, information. I was thinking, wow, it'd be great to know what the institutions are doing and then have a counterpunch express the timer trades and the direction. Um, of those colors, right? I mean, that, that was going through my head at the time. I might pick up his strategy and start using it with this. This is so versatile, but this gives you trades that are accurate, timed, and work, and have proven. So I hope you jump all over this. I hope you enjoyed this presentation. I know I was speed talking near the end, but I really wanted to spend time on those trade hacks because I want you to take away something that's gonna really mean something to you, whether you get this or not. So um, that's about it. Let me just see, Jeanette, do I have time for a couple questions? Um, uh, you, sure, you sure do, take a couple questions. Okay, so Steve asked, lifetime access to both code for the platforms and trade room. But lifetime access to the um, platform, of course, and the trade room. I mean, we usually offer it for a year, but every time someone runs out of their time, they send me an email and ask me for another year, and I usually say yes. So, I mean, <laughs> I mean, I can't promise lifetime access to the trade room because I've been doing it for 18 years, and I'm not sure how long my life's going to be. So, uh, the answer to you is you're going to get as much time as you need in the trade room. I'm going to make sure you master the strategy. Uh, thank you for your valuable presentation. Can you use it for individual stocks? Yes, Joseph, you certainly can. It's fantastic. And I would actually encourage you using the, the, the training that I teach with this program to build a roster of the best uh, trading stock charts. And then you master, get really good at it, and you just focus on those. And no more hunting around for the next thing to trade. You build a list and that's what you end up trading because you could prove it to yourself first. It all boils back down to that. Um, it works on MT4. There's no auto trading, guys. Forget this auto trading nonsense. Everyone wants robots to make your life better. That's all pie in the sky stuff. I mean, what happens if you think you get filled? The automation thinks you're filled and the broker didn't fill you or whatever. It happens all the time. No, you're gonna learn how to trade with a few clicks of your mouse with a template that's really easy and doable, and you're gonna be like the cook in the kitchen who's cooking your dish, and then you're gonna be done, all right? Like I said, get in, get out, get done. Don't spend your whole life trading. Auto trading, this is not what this is, and I would not encourage that for most people. It's way more advanced and way harder, even though it shouldn't be, it is. All right, artificial intelligence is dumb. <laughs> it really is. Um, what's next? Um, I think I answered all your questions. I showed the daily spy that Greg wanted, but I didn't get to spend enough time on it, but I do think I'm out of time. Send me your email, troy at backpacktrader.com. I'm happy to engage with you and talk to you about your trading and help you in any way I can. Jump all over this Counterpunch Express too, because this price has to go up. There's been big time inflation. We all know it. I can't keep this price at 497 for much longer. Jeanette and I are gonna have a conversation about that. The backpacktrader.com slash join. And I hope to see you in the trade room as early as this Monday. Jeanette, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. I love you, love your audience, love Toast to Traders, and I hope you invite me back.